Good morning, Hawks. Wake up. It's time for another morning announcement brought to you by Hawk News Live and the cast of Hawk TV. Good morning, Spruce Creek. Please stand for the pledge. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Spruce Creek store is now open. We sell t-shirts. Polos. And jackets. Come on down to Mr. Parker's room, LO4. Good morning, Spruce Creek. I'm Noelle Midkiff. And I'm Angelo Sile, and this is Hawk News Live for Wednesday, October 26th. Congratulations to our teachers, staff, and volunteers of the month. Our volunteer is Ms. Mrs. Liz Pashal, staff member Shauna Butler, special projects teacher Mrs. Karen Merrill, her educational atmosphere Mrs. Daniela Miles, teaching technique Mrs. Barbara Bailey, and our teacher of the month is Mrs. Kelly Bunza. Congratulations to all of our Hawks re recognized in the month of October. Don't forget to attend the luncheon in your honor at the Black Hawk Inn on Thursday at 11.15 and your presence is also requested in the main office at 7 a.m. Thursday morning to have your photo taken by Dean Stewart Photography. See you then. Volusia County Schools received approval from the Florida Department of Education for the lost time during the hurricane days. Uh, the following days were made up. Five early release days will revert to regular days, November 9th, 16th, and 30th, and December 7th and 14th. For the two remaining days, one day was made up on Friday, October 21st, and the final day will be made up on Monday, February 20th. Seniors who did not complete a diploma name verification card during Senior Activities Day, please see Ms. Davis in the main office. On the class retakes are November 3rd. If you need a picture, for, picture form, see Coach Mowry. Attention students, the University of Miami has rescheduled and will be here on Monday, October 31st at lunchtime in the main atrium. Please plan on stopping by to learn more about becoming a hurricane. Stop by your counselor's office or JROTC to sign up for the ASVAB Career Explor Exploration Test, also known as the Military Entrance Exam, on November 2nd, 2016 in the Media Center from 7.30 to 11.15. Come see what skill sets you have for a variety of careers and sign up. Auditions for the Tony Award winning musical Into the Woods will be held on November 3rd and 4th. If you are interested in auditioning or working on the production, please stop by the auditorium or the activities office to pick up an application. Completed applications will be due by November 1st. Auditions are open to all students of Spruce Creek High School. Congratulations to Courtney Sexton. Now here's a chance to win another two tickets to Ader's Haunted House, which will be tonight, Thursday, and Friday from 5 to 8 p.m. Your question is, which video game is this character from? Please email your first and last name to 2 scary school at gmail.com. That's 2 scary 4 school at gmail.com. Let's take a look at their commercial. If you're interested in making change happen, being active in the political process, or just want free cupcakes, stop by the Young Democrats Club's first meeting this Thursday at lunch in room C11. SJ Class of 2019 is sponsoring a clothing and shoe drive starting Monday, October 31st to benefit the homeless and less fortunate in the Daytona Beach area. Uh, gently used, clean, or new men's clothing is high priority, but women and children's clothing will also be accepted. All donations will be brought to Ms. Piper's room, M24. PAC will be selling the Light Up Spirit bracelets at the Ader Haunted House. Remember, the club that buys the most bracelets till Christmas gets a pizza party. Seniors, time is running out to get your senior ads in. Drop off your ads in room 022. 
Time is running out for senior photos to be scheduled at Dean Stewart Photography. The deadline is November 4th. You may also sign up for a time at school on November 10th. You need to sign up with Coach Mowry in room 022. The yearbook is at $90. Purchase yours online or room 022 today before the prices go up. It's nearly here. Trick or treat for UNICEF. Break open that piggy bank for a good cause on Monday. Watch the UNICEF video after the morning announcements. That's all for today. We'll see you in the news. It's a great day to be a hawk. Take one. Trick or treat! Trick or treat for UNICEF! Trick or treat for UNICEF! Trick or treat for UNICEF! For over 60 years, young people have helped other kids by trick or treating for UNICEF. It's an American tradition. And after six decades, trick or treat for UNICEF is still going strong. Let me ask you something. Do, do you know what UNICEF stands for? It's United Nations Children's Fund. And it helps children who are sick or hungry all over the world. This Halloween, our kids will be on your doorstep again. Please drop a few coins in the orange box. For them, Halloween is a lot of fun. For UNICEF's children, it's a chance for a better life. Help by putting as much money as you can in the orange UNICEF trick-or-treat boxes this Halloween. Won't you help the children help the children? Trick-or-treat for UNICEF!